Each year, the Champions Tour heads north and crosses the U.S. border. I think it's real important that if we can play in other places and not just in the United States to try to expand our fan base and expand our tour. And for two straight weeks, the sports-loving country of Canada plays host. There's a spirit in Canada. They're always looking for you to hit a good shot. They're always looking for something great. They really respect the game. In Calgary, they get a lot of people, so it's fun. And Fred Couples gave them something to get excited about at the Shaw Charity Classic. I came from way back. And on 18, on Sunday, I drove it in the left rough, but I got a nice lie and I hit a really good shot just left of the green and had a pretty simple chip. Oh, wow. Just like that, Fred Couples takes the lead. And then a minute later, a guy came up and said, Billy Andre just hit an iron a foot from the hole and he just made eagle two. Look at Whoa. this shot by Billy Andre. So then we went to a playoff and, and I got very lucky and hit a great little pitch in there for Birdie. Oh, he almost did it again. What a day for Fred Couples, shoots 61 and then wins on the first hole of sudden death. The next week, the tour traveled east for the Quebec Championship, where one of the rookies proved to have the finishing touch. Whoa, West Short Jr. He pours it right in the middle. That could be the winning shot here at the Quebec Championship. He did it. What a finish for West Short. Birdie, birdie, eagle. With an impressive victory, West Short Jr. raised his first trophy on the Champions Tour and closed the book in Canada. They really supported both terms we had there. I finished fifth and first there, so I'm thinking about moving there.